how's it going? I'm just really broken hearted by the news lately. No, I know it's crazy out there. Right. I can't believe it's 2020 and we're still talking about this. How can we still be dealing with this in America? Right, you're upset and then you go and just destroy a bunch of property. What? Like that's gonna help. Oh, what? No, I just thought you were talking about the fact that another black person was killed in police custody this week. Oh, no, no, I'm upset about that, sure. Oh, you sound upset. It's just that there's a right way and a wrong way to protest, and this is the wrong way. So what's the right way? I mean, I think if you're going to protest effectively, you should do it quietly. Quietly. Non-violently. Non-violently. Right. So like kneeling before a football game. Right. No, no, that's a bad example. I'm sorry. I'm just saying that just because you're really angry and upset, mm -hmm. it doesn't give you an excuse to go and break the law. I see. So the law is important to you. Right. Yes. And you don't think people should break the law. Right. Like gathering in a Capitol building with a lot of semi-automatic weapons to try and intimidate politicians. Exact. No, that's another bad example. Ah, bad example again. I just think that this is a lot of wasted energy because it's not going to do any good if you're only going to be loud and obnoxious and violent and destructive, then no no one's going to listen to you. You're not really going to make any progress, right? And we're still going to be divided. You do agree that people should be able to protest against racial injustice and violence, right? Look, I'm for equality. Mm -hmm. I mean, all lives matter, right? Mm. I'm not a racist. I have black friends. Yes, I know you have black friends. You've told me. I'm just saying that if you're going to make any progress, you should do this in a way so that you don't make other people uncomfortable or angry. No, I think I got it. So you want people to be able to protest, they should just do it at home, behind closed doors, where no one else can see or hear it or be Wait. affected by it in any way. No, I don't think you understand. No, no, I, uh, I think I understand it pretty well. I, I'm not a racist.